Time, march. Left turn, march. Colors, hope. Three cents, colors. Oh, 
Born and raised in Hollywood, she has been an active and involved member of the Brown County community for over 50 years as a student, teacher, and parent. Deborah is the mother of two sons, both of whom attend Brown County Public Schools, and she is the widow of Chris Hickson, the athletic director of Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School, who tragically lost his life on February 14, 2018, while trying to disarm the shooter. Deborah's career in education began in 1989 as a science teacher and swim coach at Blaine Healy High School. In 1994, she transferred to South Broward High School, where she continued to teach and serve as a swim coach for over 15 years and as a water polo coach for 10. At South Broward, she sponsored numerous clubs, including Girls' Gig, Shark Club, ROV, and Interact. She has a Harvest Drive organizer for South Broward for 10 years. Additionally, Deborah has held several peer leadership roles, including Merchant, Workshop Facilitator, Nesto, Marzana Facilitator, Ace Assessor, I could go on and on. What she means to the Broward County Athletic Association is one of our biggest champions. She not only came to our department to learn about our needs, she took action shortly thereafter to find solutions. She's someone that I have a great deal of respect for, someone that leads with our clerk and also has a passion for what's right. I want to introduce you to our amazing school board vice chair, Deborah Hicks. over 
296 documented volunteer service hours. Samantha plans to attend Vanderbilt University uh, as a Cornelius Vanderbilt Scholar or Georgia Institute of Technology as the stands president of scholarship on um, Scholar Commons. Please help me welcome and congratulate Samantha Perosi. Thank you. 
you, Charity for Champions. The next six scholarships will be going in the name of someone that um, was a mentor to me and was invaluable to our county public schools. He served in our district for 35 years in uh, various uh, positions, two of which that are prominent as chief of staff, but he was also the director of athletics and student activities um, who uh, mentored me when I came into school in 2016. He created the Brown County Athletic Association. He had a vision of branding athletes and, and promoting Broward County. And the BCA was his vision, very forward thinking at the time. And he created 23 special events from all-star games to big eight tournaments to scholarship awards like, like this. If it wasn't for Jamie and Hutton on, we certainly would not be sitting here um, you know, 36 years later. So I want to uh, say that he would have been here this evening. He was someone that definitely would have uh, participated in every athletic event that we had. But uh, uh, in the summer of 2016, just a month and a half after he retired, he passed away while he was vacationing in Greece. I say this because he was a man of integrity, he was brilliant, he had great character, but he was loved by so many. So we created the Damien Hockenbach Scholarship as a special way to give back. And these six recipients, I hope that you would hold Damien for what he stood for and moving forward in your life. The first recipient of the Damien Hockenbach Scholarship is a four-year member of the soccer and volleyball teams. She was selected to participate in the 2023 BCAA All-Star Soccer Classic and the 2022 BCAA All-Star Volleyball Classic. She is a member of the Future Athletic Administrative Club in which she served as president. She is a member of the Student Government Association, Mentoring Tomorrow's Leaders, and the Culture Club. She was a Debbie Wasserman Schultz Game Changer Award recipient in 2022. She was selected Student of the Month in November by the City of Hollandale Beach. She is ranked third in a class of 230 and has 505 documented volunteer service hours. She has been accepted to Mississippi State University and Louisiana State University, but is undecided which college or university she will be attending. Please join me in congratulating from Hollandale High School, Rebecca Lewis. Our next 
recipient is a four-year member of the baseball team. He has advanced to the Florida High School Athletic Association districts. He was selected to the Perfect Game All-Tournament team. He has received honors for Principal's Honor Roll, Outstanding Underclassman Award, and the Area Marine Science National Merit Candidate, and Advanced International Certificate of Education Diploma with Merit Recipient. He is a member of the Academic Village Postmentary, served as president. The Academic Village Mentoring Program and the Fishing Department. <laughs> he volunteers with Chase Stocking Children. He currently is ranked 43 in a class of 415. He has 122 documented volunteer service hours and plans to attend Landry University on an academic and baseball scholarship. Please join me and congratulate Pembroke Pines Charter High School. Paul Our fifth recipient is a four-year member of the volleyball team serving as captain. She was a two-year member of the soccer team and a woman one-year member of the softball team. She was selected to participate in the 2022 PCAA All-Star Volleyball Classic. She has been taking advanced placement and honors classes. She's a member of the Art Club serving as president. She has volunteered to paint the walls of her school. <coughs> She's currently ranked 86 in a class of 283 and 102 uh, documented volunteer service hours. Please join me in welcoming uh, from Strainingham High School, who's undecided where she's going to college right now, Angelique Thompson.
has 148 documented volunteer service hours. Cameron plans to attend the University of Central Florida. Please help me congratulate our keynote speaker for receiving the Western High School. Tonight's first recipient of the BSN Sports Scholar Athlete Award 
is a four-year member of the basketball team and a three-year member of the flag football team. She has advanced to the FHSAA Districts and Regional in basketball and the FHSAA Districts in flag football. She was the captain of the basketball team this year and was selected to participate in the 2023 BCAA All-Star Basketball Classic. She has been on the principal's honor roll the past three years and volunteers at Pantheron Elementary. She is ranked 45th in a class of 555 and has 361 documented volunteer service hours. She plans to attend the University of Central Florida. Congratulations to Asia Allen from Flanagan High School. Regionals and 
state championship means. He is an advanced placement scholar with honors and has earned academic excellence in advanced placement in chemistry, advanced placement in computer science, and advanced placement in Spanish. He has earned his advanced international certificate of education diploma with merit with academic excellence in AICE English literature, psychology, and international history. And has won first place in a number of regional science Olympiad events qualifying for state level competitions. He is head of the test and strength and stream group for South Florida Aquatic Club Live Streams and is the founder of Suits for Summer. He volunteers with the Miracle League, Miami Dolphins Foundation Food Relief Program, and South Florida Aquatic Club. He is ranked two in the class of 441 and has 361 documented volunteer service hours. Alejandro thanks to attend Carnegie Mellon University. Please come down to the podium from Everly High School.
head of the other districts in the county or in the state to get our athletes back. Uh, actually, our athletes went back before the students did, and uh, Tony Miliano is a big part of that. He uh, does an amazing job uh, within Joe Madrid Children's Hospital, and uh, we're very proud that he represents Brown County as the athletic trainer, manager, and coordinator. Please welcome Mr. Tony Miliano. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, everybody. On behalf of Jordan Bonjo Children's Hospital, I'd like to congratulate all uh, scholar athletes here today. I'd like to congratulate your parents, your family members. It's a big night for all of you. On behalf of Jordan Bonjo Children's Hospital, the first recipient of a scholarship award is a four-year member of the basketball team serving as captain for three years. He has received a Heisman Scholar Athlete Award and was selected to participate in the 2023 BCAA All-Star Basketball Classic. He was, a, he was on the Principal's Honor Roll, receiving straight A's for consecutive years. He is a member of the Students Working Against Tobacco National Honor Society and peers as partners, where he assists ESC students in his high school. He volunteers at a local daycare, the YMCA of Hollywood, and mentoring local middle school athletes at Driftwood Middle School and ATOS Middle School. He is ranked 75th in a class of 378 and has 150 documented volunteer service hours. He plans to attend Nova Southeastern University, Stetson University, or the U University of Miami. Let's congratulate from Hollywood Hills, Jeremiah Posey. Children's Hospital Scholarship Award goes to a four-year member of the lacrosse team. She's taken advanced international certificate of education classes and has earned straight A's for the past three years. She's a member of the Aquarium Club serving as tank manager. She served as the vice president of her freshman class, treasurer of her sophomore class, and president of her junior class. She was a member of the Health Occupation, Occupation Students of America, Distributive Education Clubs of America, Mu Alpha Theta, Environmental Restoration Ambassador, and the Animal Science Program. She's a lifeguard at the David Posner Jewish Community Center. She has earned her Animal Science Specialist Certificate. She's earning her Emergency Medical Technician Certification by working with firefighters during, the, during five 12-hour shifts. She volunteers with the Relay for Life, the American Cancer Society, Toys for Tots, the Humane Society of Broward County, the Teen Court of Broward County, Canine Companions for Independence, BBYO, ISERV, Plantation Acres Homeowners Association, Saving Sage Animal Rescue, and her temple, Ramah Shalom. She is ranked 33rd in a class of 479 students and has a school record of 4,516 documented volunteer service hours. Amazing. She plans to attend the University of North Carolina. Join me in congratulating from South Plantation High School, Lexi Trappenberg. Honor Society. 
She has served in the future healthcare professionals, patriotic readers, marine biology, and providing for animals without shelter. She has 304.3 documented volunteer service hours. She plans to attend the University of Florida or the University of Central Florida. Let's congratulate from St. Thomas Aquinas, Isabella Rupolo. He has helped his team advance to Florida High School Athletic Association districts, FHSAA Regionals, and FHSAA State. He was selected to participate in the 2022 BCAA All-Star Football Classic. He is a recipient of honorable mention by the Miami Herald in 2021 through 2022, and 2022 through 2023. All-Star Basketball Honorable Mention for Basketball and Football. He is a member of the National Honor Society and Early Childhood Education Program. He has received the MVP Award for Basketball and Football, Most Coachable Award, and the Best Senior Stats Award. He is a volunteer at Make the Play Basketball Camp. He is ranked 307 in a class of 656 and has 137 documented volunteer service hours. He plans to attend St. Thomas University from West Broward High School. Let's congratulate Brandon Armenteros. Hours. 
She plans to attend the University of Florida, LaSalle Plantation. Join me in congratulating Natalie Worth. Our next five scholarships are the BC 
NCAA Merit Awards. The first recipient is a four-year member of the soccer team where she is co-captain and has played for the FHSA District of Regional Championship four years in a row. It was an FHSA state runner-up in 2020 through 22. She was a three-year member of the cross-country team and qualified for the FHSA state championship. She has been a recipient of the Pre-Calculus Honors Award for Academic Excellence, Scholastic Art and Writing Awards with one gold key, four silver keys, and four honorable mentions, College Board Advanced Placement Scholar with Distinction, College Board Hispanic Recognition, Advanced International Certificate of Education Certificate of Spanish Language with Distinction in Speaking, Most Improved Athlete in Cross Country, Superintendent's Advanced Placement Studio of Art, Jury Exhibition, Congressional Art Competition for High School Students, and she, I guess on her free time, is an officer for National Art Honor Society, a member of National Honor Society, and a member and competitor for View Out the Theta. She volunteers at American Youth Soccer Organizations, Coral Springs Museum of Art, Beanie, South Florida, and the Frank C. Owens Art Gallery. She is ranked 11th in a class of 11,103 and has 386 documented volunteer service hours. She plans to attend Carnegie Mellon University or University of Michigan. Coach Barry. She represents Cypress Bay High School, Ms. Isabel Baez.
Russell. He is ranked 119 in class of 283 and has 79 documented volunteer services. He plans to attend Albany State University or the United States Naval Academy. She was selected to participate in the 2023 BCA All-Star Soccer Classic. She is a recipient of the 2022 Cambridge Scholar Award, the 2022 Superintendent's Advanced Placement Art Exhibition Honorable Mention for her photography, and Advanced International Certificate of Education Diploma recipient. She volunteers caring and fostering for rescue groups such as Pooches and Pines, Good Karma Pet Rescue, and Rhode Nation Rottweiler Rescue, Rhode Nation. She has volunteers at she has volunteered at the Pepper Pines Charter Early Learning Center West Campus. She's currently ranked 73 in a class of 415 and has 125 documented volunteer service hours. She plans to attend the University of Central Florida or the University of South Florida Nobles from Pepper Pines Charter High School, Caitlin Fernandez. He is a member of Miramar Pembroke Pines 
Capital A Leadership Mentoring Program, serving as treasurer, National Achievers Society, Urban League of Robert County, and the Fort Lauderdale chapter of Link's White Wealth Program. He is ranked sixth in the class of 441 and has 247 documented volunteer service hours. He plans to attend the University of Florida. Help me congratulate from Everglades High School, Randy Smith Jr. She's the owner of a tutoring company covering the lower income families. Vice President of the National Honor Society. She 
volunteers with helping adults with autism for four next health in the local A. St. Austin chapter. Taylor is served 15th in the past 1103 and has 412 documented volunteer service hours. Taylor plans to attend the University of Michigan. From Cypress Bay High School, Taylor Levine. Chris Hickson was an athletic director, coach, and campus monitor. During his 20 plus year career within Broward County Public Schools, he was a proud faculty member of Blanche Ealing High School, South Broward High School, and Marjorie Stillman Douglas High School. Chris Hickson was also a retired United States Navy mechanic, uh, machinist mate first class, having served 27 honorable years, five active duty and 22 reserve in support of our great nation. His love for his student athletes was well known by all. He also went the extra mile to ensure that they were taken care of and to continue his legacy and to continue to take care of student athletes, his wife Deborah, his sons Corey and Tommy, and a family friend near and dear to the Hicksons, Jessica Paolino, have created a scholarship in his name for student athletes at his three former schools and have plans to extend that in the future. Please welcome the Hickson family along with Jessica Paolino.
We are honored to announce the 2023 winners of the Chris Hickson Athletic Scholarship. Good evening. Our first recipient is a four-year member of the track and field, soccer, and cross-country teams, serving as captain for track and, track and field and cross-country. She has advanced the Florida High School Athletic Association Districts, FHSAA Regionals, and FHSAA State Championship in track and field and cross-country. She's a two-time All-Broward Honorable Mention selection by the Sun Sentinel, and was district champions in soccer and cross country. I can tell you this individual is truly amazing. Um, she has been honored and recognized by many individuals in our community, including Representative Debbie Wasserman Schultz for the Citizenship Award. We are happy to recognize Kennedy Lerner from Cooper City High School. Our next scholarship recipient is a member of the basketball and softball team, including the volleyball team and a three-year member of her soccer team. She has received many awards, including most improved for her continued commitment to her sports and academics. She's a member of Student Government Association, Math Honor Society, Science National Honor Society, Women in STEM, and Social Studies Honor Society. She has volunteered with the Covenant House and she has earned over 255 service hours. Please help me congratulate Alexandra Gonzalez from <laughs>
please help me congratulate the 2023 Chris Dixon, Athletic Director of the Year from South Plantation High School. First, this athlete participated in cross country, 
track to soccer. She had five goals and three assists this past soccer season. Was third leg of the 4 by 800 relay team that finished third at the BCAA championship. She competed in the 1600 and 3200 meter run and finished 20th at regional 4 for a cross country championship. Please help me to congratulate from Cooper City High School, Kennedy Learn. Our Boys Athlete of the Year won the 113 pound championship at the 2023 BCAA County Championship after a pin in the championship. He finished with a 68 and 3 record and won the Class 3A 106 pound state championship. This was a, he is a three time state qualifier, two time BCAA champion and finished his career with 216 victories. From Cypress Bay High School, Andrew Pumbling. Oh, 
Thomas, St. Thomas, Sopoinas, Sasha, Cartagena.
Kian Anderson. Nathaniel Green. Jeremiah Posey. Maya Rashid. Emma Rodriguez. Valeria Sanchez. And Nixie Weishaw. Jabari Johnson, Deshaun Lee, Rebecca Lewis, Kiana Lugo, and Felipe Musantes. Thank you. 